dang. Damn, man. Why, man? Why? YouTube, what's going on? It's Juan Gotti here with another video, and in today's video, <sighs> my God, fool, we have some more Redskins news, and as you can tell by my reaction, man, this is my live reaction. Shout out to Swervey J, he added me when I seen the picture of Kelvin Harmon, and it said breaking. I didn't think he tore the ACL, but I listened to Swervey J's. You know his video, I mean, or his his voiceover. See, everyone thinks he's lying. Let me play. It. Yo, Kelvin Harmon just tore his fucking ACL, yo. Oh my god, bro. As you can see right there, wide receiver set going into his second year. Kelvin Harmon has torn his ACL, bro. This is breaking news, bro. And as you can see, we we I, I, you can see my mini reaction. <sighs> Supposed to be his year, man. Supposed to be his year, man. It really was, bro. Building off a high, you know, and in, in towards the end of the season, you know, coming off hot, thirty receptions, three hundred and I think like eighteen yards. Was hot. He he caught everything his way, throwing his way. Got him out of NC State late in the draft in 2019. Hellman Hellman and Dwayne Haskins was working on their chemistry all all, all this off season. <sighs> oh my god, bro! We're still cursed, bro. <laughs> We're still cursed, man. We did a day after we change our name. Boom! Kelvin Harmon tears his ACL. think it's gonna clear up but it's there right there let me read it to you breaking news Kevin Harmon tore the ACL while training prior to camp training camp and is out for the 2020 season per Ian Rappaport this is tough heartbreaking news for a second year receiver he was competing to start alongside McLaurin and had a promising rookie year let's see if the Reds can sign a veteran receiver as far as the receiving core even thin and thinner hoping for a speedy recovery at Kevin Harmon this is hitting hard for me because you guys know Kelvin Harmon is my guy. If you watch this channel every day and every time I upload a video that we talk about receivers, you know I love Kelvin Harmon more than Terry. And that, that says something because Terry McLaurin is great and I love Terry, man. But it was just, I just saw something special out of Kelvin Harmon, man. I saw something special out of Kelvin Harmon, bro. This is this is a this is blow. This is I, I'm I'm speechless. And I already know I can hear the comments coming out. Oh, we still got AGG. That's besides the point, man. You never want to see your players get hurt. Seems like what we're always cursed with injuries, and the injury bug starts now. Last year it started with uh, Jordan Reed getting hurt in the third week of the preseason. It's starting a month earlier this season. This sucks, man. It really do. A, a, a less weapon for, for you know, Dwayne to throw to. It was already thin. Now I know we can't. We have AGG, who we know are expecting to do big things at first. Now it's like we're expecting him to do immaculate things. Now that you know, Kevin Harmon is out. Maybe this could be a blessing in disguise. 
But for Kelvin Harmon, this is such a blow because he wasn't a receiver that solidified his spot on this roster. So for all we know, this could ruin his career. It really could because a new coaching staff that really seen you play now and you already had to fight for a spot. Yeah, I'm pretty sure next year they're going to give you a chance to come back. But still, man, this blows, bro. Now we definitely got to sign a veteran receiver. Cody Latimer was already on the ropes because of his situation. Although I'm pretty sure 90% of the people that would have been put in that situation would have did the same thing for their children. He, he's still on the ropes. So we we now definitely have to sign a veteran, man. Bring your AB. At this point, you might as well, bro. This, this blows, man. It's taking everything out of me not to curse, bro. Man, I feel so bad, bro. My God, man. This this sucks, dog. Surgery went well. God got me, bro. This blows, man. As you can see, I'm really speechless right now. This is not nothing fake. This is all seriousness. You, I, I was on the PS4 party, and, and as soon as I heard it, I said, what? But all right, man, let's, let's talk about what the wide receiving core is now want to look like minus Kevin Harmon. And that, that, that hurts me to say because he was really supposed to have a big role in his offense. So now, starting, excuse me, it looks like Terry McLaurin, of course, AGG now on the outside and Steven Sims on the slot. Now it's like it's like AGG won the, the receiving battle by default because Harmon is hurt. Still got Antonio Gibson that plays wide right receiver and halfback. So I mean I know people want to bright side and look at it like we didn't lose anything because I mean either way one player either AGG or Kevin Harmon was gonna have to sit out or not get as much playing time. But you still never want to see your players get hurt. You really don't. So for this to happen to Kelvin Harmon, man, I'm really bummed out about it. But God got him like he said. This could be a blessing in disguise for the Washington football team. This could be a blessing in disguise for Kelvin Harmon. A minor setback for a major comeback. Now you have no choice, uh, Washington football team, to sign a veteran. A.B., maybe. I, I for, At first I was opposed to it because of his drama. But... Now, we have no choice. Honestly, we don't. We got to deal with the suspension that's going to come with AB, I guess. Something, Josh Gordon, something. But this really blows, man. <sighs> going to have to bring up some wide receivers from the practice squad. You know, sign some people. Darvin Kenzie, hopefully he can get his shot now. I really like Darvin Kenzie. Maybe Cam Sims has opened the door for Cam Sims. To possibly make a roster finally, because I really believe Cam Sims is really good. He just got to get his his hands right, and he got to get more consistent with his catches, because he'll be on for a period of time and then quickly turn off. I'm sorry if y'all hear that in the background, but bro, oh, god man, this really, this really blows y'all. Kelvin. Man. Not Kelvin. Y'all, because you guys know how much of a fan I was of Kelvin Harmon, bro. AGG, man. It's your time to shine, bro. And I know you're going to do well. I know AGG is going to, is, is gonna, you know, st you know, come up to the task. But it was just like we expected him to have a decent role. Now we expect him to have a big role. And I'm really hoping that he could... You know, obtain that. And I know he can. It's AGG, man. This dude is a freak, man. He can do everything in the world. He literally bowled a perfect game. He did the Rubik's Q in under a minute. He knows how to do triple backflips. This dude can do everything. So I know he'll be up for the test, but this is really a blow, man. Just like how a couple years ago, knock on some wood, when Geist got hurt, did that blue too. That was our rookie. He was supposed to come in here and have an immediate impact. And it just broke. 
But like Guy says, it's nothing you could it's nothing you could control. That's what injuries, period. But especially injuries like this, nothing you can control. You know? And guys said, like guys said, I had one major injury. So does Kevin Harmon. So I don't want people thinking this is the end of Kevin Harmon. But now, with that being said, we have more videos to cover. Like with, like more in depth of what the wide receiver score is going to look like. Who should we sign and stuff like that. So as always, main boy Juan Gotti. Like, comment, subscribe. Hello to the Redskins. Or, my bad. Hail to the Washington football team. That's going to take some time to get used to, as y'all know. Hail to the Washington football team. And get well get well soon, Kelvin. And I love you, man. I really do. You was my favorite receiver on this team. And get well soon, Kelvin. Hopefully for a speedy recovery. Come on, AGG, Darby Kinsey, Cam Sims, Trey Quinn, maybe. Major comeback. Ma ma minor setback for major comeback. Like, comment, subscribe, hello to the Washington football team. Get well, Kelvin. Peace.